Though that is one of the scariest mid-game AD teams I've ever seen. We saw a pretty ridiculous one earlier today, too. Or are we or are we invading? Cool, let's do it. It's okay. Ah. Oh no. Oh god, he's dead. Bad hook. Cool, we got an assist. Good luck, Fizz. Godspeed. Godspeed, young crab. Oh no! Don't don't die to the Olaf. F fuck's sake! Don't die to the Olaf. Ah. Uh. My question is, why the fuck didn't you flash away from under the turret? Because I think he took an extra turret shot because of that. Oh. I was hoping for this. Not happy he got a kill, but at least he didn't buy anything. God damn it, if I don't TP, I'm going to miss quite a bit. Yeah, well, not the end of the world. I only miss one melee minion. That could be a hell of a lot worse. Not burning my TP for one melee minion is not exactly a good deal, so we're okay here. Wow, he hit level 2 off the first wave. That's what that kill gave him. Damn. I get an assist. I'm not going to hit level... Well, actually, I wonder if I would have hit level 2 if, there, if I did actually teleport to the minions. Oh, he's missing farm? I don't know if he's missing XP. I really don't know where he is. Yeah, actually, it looks like I would have leveled up. Huh. Interesting. So just taking part in a single kill or killing a single ward, that's enough to hit level 2 off um, off of the first wave. Wow. Somebody just missed out on a lot of XP and CS. Looks like the Olaf wanted to face me. Cool. Well, he just missed out on the strongest part of his landing phase. We'll just target the fake. Oops. Nice, they still killed him. God damn, I missed the cannon. All right, whoever was supposed to come top lane really, really needs to come back. Because they're missing out on a ton of XP and CS. That's really bad. Got his flash. Have fun with that. Cool. I just got his flash for free. He went aggro on me and needed to burn flash. Fantastic. Unfortunately, he's now level 4, which means he could potentially kill me in a 1v1. But I think he has a healthy respect for my damage now. And it's pushing, so I can just sit back and wait. I got no reason to risk it. I just burned teleport. It would be a catastrophe if I died now. Only one more day of finals. Well, good luck to you, sir. Good luck to you. Ace those tests. Or come close enough to acing them that it doesn't really matter. Oh, 
Well, he's burning his mana pretty fast, hucking those undertoes. And he's missing. No way for me to cancel that. Got it. Right. Not gonna go any further. Because if the Olaf was in that brush, bad things could have happened. I'm six, so I've got nothing to fear because he's not. Just need to shove this all the way in. I've missed so many cannons. Ugh. Just imagine how much gold I'd have right now if I wasn't mucking that up. Cool. Now I can give. Yeah, if I was down there, I can just back away. I've got nothing to fear about a flank. Jax? Don't be an idiot. Yeah, he's going to kill this wave pretty fast. I'm going to miss out on a wave of minions. Hopefully he doesn't get a plate, too. There's no way for me to safely back, unfortunately. Is he really backing? Good. It's really weird. He shoved in one wave and then just immediately backed. Very bizarre. Because if I'm not mistaken, didn't he just get to lane? It's confusing. And he doesn't have teleport, and he hasn't gotten a kill since that very early level one. To say the least, this, this lane's going just fine. He's gonna. Oh, he got the cannon. But he missed enough of that. Cool. That was worth the life I paid for it. Why is constantly bottling? It's causing issues, I see. That's not good. He's just. Use spells. Not everybody has spells, buddy. Oh, dear. Might be dead. Nope, I'm okay. Just needed to juke one. And I did. So I live. And until I got a Bramble Vest, I'm not sure I can actually fight him. Once I have a Bramble Vest, I might be able to take him down. Until then, I just need to sit back and try and farm as best as I can. At least his ult is down. It did cost my Ghost, so it's really bad. His ult has a much shorter cooldown than that. Yes. I see you want to be incredibly annoying. That's fine. Feel free. I'll just get XP for cannon. I don't need the I don't need the money. I've been missing with the cannons all day anyways. It's better this way, right? Gives me a challenge. Also, I'm not an idiot. I know what Olaf can do if he gets ahead. I'd rather just sit back and wait till I get those big power spikes I need. Didn't quite get him under the tower. Pretty good, though. I got him low enough to be concerning. Crap, I don't have enough mana to do this. won't do anything. Come on, you 
got this gin. Yes, he does have it. Nice. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't actually press R. My ult went out on its own, I think. I mean, I was slamming on R until I noticed that his ult was running. I stopped pressing it, and two seconds later, it still went out. Not two seconds. It was like one second later, but still. I need to shut this all the way out. I can't let this sit here. And thank you, Jin. That was the perfect fucking timing. And see, the crazy thing is his ult was up again. So my ghost is almost back up, so maybe it was a lot longer than I thought. Um, let's get that Bramble vest I've been demanding. This allows me to win the long fight. Without Bramble, I can't actually beat him in the long fight. Let's also get boots, because scary. I may want to get, uh, um, hmm, maybe Swifties is what I want. Normally, or Tap, no, I should get Tap. It's all AD team, I should definitely get Tap. Is there a guy to duelist? He is now. Post 9 or post 13, he is a, one of the best duelists in the game. What do you think Urgot smells like? Um, oil and shit, really? Probably. Let's be honest, man. He doesn't have, like, a shit pan, but it needs to go somewhere. And he's huge, man. He, he probably sweats up a storm. It's fine. As you can see, I can duel with him just fine. I made a gamble and did not pay off. God, it's annoying how much longer Conquer stacks last on him. Boom. Shotgun! Nice ignite. Yeah, my ult wasn't going to do anything until his ult ended. Unfortunately, I think his ult lasts longer than mine, so that was a waste of my ult. I never should have thrown it. Because it wasn't going to slow him down, and I guess that means it was never actually going to kill him, because it was never going to... Like, his ult was going to be up while mine ended. That was actually just a complete waste of resources. But hey, I did get two turret plates. And a kill. I'll take it. Now I can probably handle the Olaf on my own. With the lead I have now, it should be pretty easy. Unfortunately, their Vi is getting to the point where she can solo carry. I have enough to deal with topside right now. Cool, I will have a plate advantage. Oh, we're not gonna get him. I'm just gonna TP up. Oh, he backed, cool. Makes things easy. I don't know why you would do that. He literally just made it back to lane. This is the second time I've seen him do this. And I'm going to punish him. I'm going to possibly, maybe... No, I will take the turret before he gets here. The, the plates are down. It's just going to die. That was an incredibly stupid thing to do. Okay, I won't just die. But it was close. Yeah, while well, your axe is over there and you're too afraid to go to pick it up, I'm not afraid of you. You cause me no fear. You cause me no fear. 
You should fear me. Unfortunately, I fear that my team is going to cost me this game now. Because unfortunately, our Lucian is 1 and 6. Oh, does she think she can take me? Nope. Nope. Sorry. You don't win. And I missed my Q, too. And she had red buff. Oh, and a shitload of kills. Oops. Sorry, once Urgot hits that one big power spike, you really don't want to be alone against him. So, when you were asking earlier if Urgot's a good duelist, Exhibit A, Exhibit B. Good duelist. Once you outscale them, yeah, good duelist. It's just this. And I've outscaled them. I outscaled the 7 and 3 Vi. Well, excuse me. She was 7 and 2 at the time. My, now, the problem is that right now we got a bot lane where our AD carry is, uh, well, useless, is a generous term. Uh, oh, nice. It worked out. They turned it against them completely. They may get two kills out of that. Oh dear. They're all dead for that turret. They took the turret, but it was a massacre. We're going to lose a turret of our own. Hopefully, we can pick up a turret either bot lane or mid lane. If we can get either one of these, it would be great. If we get both of them, even better. Because we're not getting mid. Too many of them. And unfortunately, it looked like the Shinja wasted half of his um, shit on the clone, not on the, the actual monkey. Teleport for another 75 seconds. Oh no, she's dead. But, that's a kill, I think. Not gonna work now. I love how the Shinja said that's what I get for trying to help when he's running like a good distance in front of me. Why, why were you there? Why didn't you just wait for me to arrive? Uh. Team's fighting when we don't have the numbers. I don't have teleport. Why are they fighting? I even popped ghost to try and get to that fight faster and it wasn't fast enough. By the time I arrived, I just died too. Ugh, that was fucking terrible. That was just awful. Urgot outscales Darius casually. There's few champions Urgot does not outscale. And thank you, Malvister, for saying that. Thank you very much. 
I appreciate that. Why do I regret teleporting here? Fuck! Yeah, Lucian's probably not the right target to be going for, guys. Ugh. Yeah, he did at least get that, too. Why not? Darius old fear champion, that'd be ridiculous, please no. It's a resettable execute, he doesn't need fear. If I was gonna... it's fine, Thresh down here. I'll stick around. I could go join the team, but I see two of them. There's no reason for me to do that right now. Power is it? Damn it. Too much CC between the two of them. A little less CC and I would have been fine. Yeah, and I knew the Vi was there too. Oh god. This is not gonna work. Or is it? Huh. Almost. Dang. If he managed to get that last hit, that would have worked. And she doesn't have her R. Oh, these guys are all gonna die. Sucks for us. Got him. And I'll live. Cool. That was a big shutdown. Jesus, how much fucking... How many kills does he have? 13 and 4. Oh, I see why we're losing now. Good God. Well, at least we get a Baron, probably. Ooh, your fucking surrender boats. Yeah, the 2 and 9 Lucian. Just imagine if we had an AD carry. Funny thing is, he actually has more completed items than theirs. Though his are cheap. And their AD carry is 579. The problem is the Wukong, the Vi. I mean, we can definitely win this game. Really? What world do you think you're going to be changing the outcome of this? Pfft. Everybody left but the Xinjiao, and he didn't have Smite for some reason. He must have used it during the fighting. We really should just back and buy now. More armor. As much armor as I can get my filthy hands on. This game is all 80 from them. We can win this. Only 
I have many famous last words. I say them all the time. And I regret about half of them, I'd say. The round I'm taking is dangerous. Not too dangerous. You caught, boy. You caught. Very good. Hmm. Our base name may need some protection. I mean, I mean, oh yes? Got you. I still got you. Oh. <laughs> still got you. Six legs, gotta move fast. I am pretty fed now. Eight, four, and seven. Ah, oh, yeah. we can win this one. We can win this one. Their team comp's great in the mid game, but their scaling sucks. Everything about this team basically says if the team fight doesn't go just right, basically the Wukong, they're gonna lose every fight if the game goes on long enough because that the comp just doesn't scale well. Yeah, we need to wait till we're grouped. Because we win the grouped fights. Shockingly enough, we actually win them. We really should be pushing the mid. That's nice. <laughs> you just trolled him well. Oh, there goes our Baron buff. Glad our Nip's coming back. We really need to group. Multiple cannons, that's just ridiculous. Yeah, join the team. Oh dear. This teleport is going to cost me my life. Yeah, I'm just dead. Or I get a kill out of that somehow? Wow. Wow, nice one, Audrey. We actually came out even that fight. Wow. Nice. I survived a lot longer than I should have. Alright, what else do I need to get? Randuins? Yeah, Randuins looks good. Yep, yeah, Randuins. I also really should get Tenacity Potion. Oh my god, I should. <laughs> Thank you. You bring a smile to my face. 
really hope that was loud enough. Nice. And then they should get out. I mean, the good news is, short of three of them fighting me at once, I can potentially win a 1v2. 1v1, I don't know if there's anyone on their team that can actually take me. I've got my core, and that counters each and every one of them. Well, there's no one near enough to deal with me yet. They're not heading towards me in a hurry. It's a decent ward. So I've got Ghost Glory. I can easily run her down and kill her. Dead monkey, if I've ever seen one. Very, very dead monkey. That's probably game. They threw everything into that. They lost a GA as well. What a disaster. They should not have gone for that. The pit was a death trap. Absolute death trap. money to get what I want. Shinchao's backing. Oh, he's okay. No, he isn't. Got him. Oh my god, this game's over. No, oh, fuck it. No, we're killing you too, I'm afraid. I'm afraid we're killing you too. God, they surrendered! We won that! Yes! Holy shit! We actually won that game! They were kicking our asses in the early game, weren't they? Our AD carry was massively in the hole. Our mid and bot lane weren't doing too great. I mean, our mid lane was doing okay. Our jungle was doing okay. I... I thought they had a huge lead, didn't they? What the hell happened? Um... Let's give it to the Shin Zhao. I don't really know who did the best on our team. Yeah, Shin Zhao. It was him. Cool. I picked correctly. I did my fair share of damage to go with it. Wow, Zyra was our damage carry, not surprising. What's surprising is that she did nearly double the damage of our AD carry, who was our lowest source of damage. Ouch! If I were an ADC and this was what happened, I'd feel a little insulted. The support was the real carry. Should have just let her farm for you. Um, can't leave it as much as Thrash. Did she? Oh, so she did. <laughs> I see they had similar troubling matters. <laughs> only our support did considerably better than theirs. That's the only difference. I mean, their support was fine. He definitely screwed me over a couple of times, but well, Zyra did a lot more damage, and in cases like this, it matters. 
And yeah, the support carry. Very impressive. Very impressive. Oh, wow. I Wait, I ended up with the most gold? Really? Is jungle farm not worth as much, or is it just all from those assists? Or did I get some extra plates they didn't get? It's actually a little confusing. How did I have the most gold on our team? Also, holy fuck, their monkey had more gold than me. He was full... No, he wasn't full built. He was almost full built. But damn, that's ridiculous. He was their only power. That's the reason why they lost. Everyone else was weak. Just weak. The Olaf did not just roll over the lane. And because of that, he just didn't end up doing as much as he needed to do. And then you look at their AD carry, and her score doesn't look doesn't look much better than our AD carry score. That's just that's not gonna cut it. The Thresh is fine. 1928, that's a fine score for a support. He did okay. Yeah, I think he was just fine. He was him and the monkey were probably the uh, the two shining stars on their team.